Hello, welcome back to Tristale, episode 7,447, I think, maybe, I don't know, it's up there. A little too many episodes, so maybe the next play, let's play, I'll do more off camera. And kind of show the major stuff, I don't know, we'll see. But uh, anyway, that's for another day. Today, um, we're going to probably pretty much do most of the same as we did last episode. Try and fin finish it out, you know, framing this area out. And you know, convert these to regular roads, and maybe start to, you know, add some utilities and run the water and all that stuff. And then um, we're gonna go ahead and put some more barracks down right now, so that we can get the, our workers up to like the available workspace up to like 1,200 maybe. I'll put them down here. Where is that at? Where we are or I was like, what, what are we doing? We don't have one of these buildings down. I mean, we can put one of these down. Wait, uh, we, I have no. These are big. Everything's so big. I have no place to put it. We can put it here. I want, I want to move that later, for sure. That's going to get moved. That's not where I'm staying. That's not its permanent home. That's its temporary home to make more workers. Oh, missed the spot. Can't get that spot that I want to get there. It is. Oh, it's not in the area that I, I want. It's not in my zonable ore area. All right, let's see where we're at. 1160. That might be enough. So, in case you're wondering, what are these randomly putting down barracks and stuff? Well, one, I don't need the production. So we're, we're producing, we're, we're fairly well dialed in in terms of number of resources, you know, number of extractors, number of producers for what our current demand is. So I don't want to really add any more extractors. And um, I mentioned this before in the last episode, but I'll mention it again in case this is, uh, you know, your first time jumping in, because I might have labeled this one an ore industry hits level five. And like, oh, I want to see how you hit level five with ore industry. That's great. It's like, well, you know, it's level four now, so you're not going to see a whole lot. But I guess you're going to listen to this. And uh, basically, what I found with the game is um, it doesn't want to, it rarely ever fills the jobs available 100%. You look here, you know, we have 1160 worker locations and we got 638 before we were at like eight something, right? I always, so I always, if I want to push an industry to level, I always give about 30% or so more jobs then I need so if I need 800 I'm gonna put down enough things whatever those things may be to get to like 1100 we'll say 1200 10 a thousand to 80 whatever and why and that's because like I said the game just doesn't want to fill all the spots and it could in my unemployment's uh, not that low I mean it might be now I put all this stuff down it's five percent so, I mean, there's people that are able-bodied workers that could work there, just for whatever reason, it just doesn't do that. And maybe you know why. You can post a comment down below. So I find over oversizing it, so to speak, with providing more jobs available, will get you, will make the people fill in real fast. So now we'll get to 800 pretty quick. We're at, we were at like six something, like low six, and then we already got like 50 people. So, um, and we'll just let it go. We have another 20,000 or so units to, to make. So by the time we hit that, we'll probably be pretty close. If we need to zone just a little bit more, we can zone a little bit more in some of this space here to, to boost up the number of people in this area. And then once we hit level five, we're gonna destroy all, pretty much all this. All these are gonna go away. I'm gonna probably won't have any. Actually, I won't have any because I don't wanna take away jobs from my forestry, which is gonna be the next thing to level, level five. And when, once that gets to level five, then you know we'll, I'll be looking at well let's like make it look a little bit better. Do I want to ha have one or two barracks in each area? Maybe the maintenance building and and, and all that. Like where can I fit it? How do, you know how do I want it to look? I get more into like the particulars. Right now it's all about just slamming down some things, getting this production. And of course these are where I want them to be, so this will stay. But then, like I said, the barracks and stuff and some of these, um, you know, fiberglass plants. Or glass, yeah, these are glass plants. Yeah, fiberglass, right? Or glass. The other ones, I think, fiberglass. But anyway, we might change where they are. 
just because I'm like, eh, I had to throw them down just to get the population up, or the worker population up, I should say. All right, so that's that spiel. Back to doing, so another thing we're doing is uh, building roads, fun, fun roads. Our next tile was opened up and we need people. We need the people to push to this tile. That's the next tile we're gonna get because that'll be a mixed tile of residential and commercial. We have commercial available to zone in here still. So if we need to, to raise that, we will. But I, I've been holding off on raising or increasing our commercial demand because I, I don't want people to go there to work. I want people to go to my industry and work. So we're, we're kind of holding off on the commercial for now. We're providing enough commercial to kind of meet what we need, maybe a little less. And uh, yeah, and then once we fill in these people, that'll provide more people as well that can hopefully get to this area. It'll drive up our commercial demand pretty high. And then we'll, we'll start zoning some more commercial in here. It'll open up this tile and we'll, more do more, we'll do some commercial, maybe an IT cluster over there on that tile. All right, so back to doing to some residential developments. Developments are fun. Do I want to keep this road? I don't know. So I can just do that, and I can do something like this. Do we want to make this across? Or do we want to keep it like open space? Yeah, keep it open space. Let me put a little rock in there, some trees. Do we want to put a park in here somewhere? I have P for park here, but I might make this commercial. It's a little commercial area for these folks over here. And I thought I was going to put a park in here, between here and here. Carry this park through, but make it a separate zone park. And that'll encourage people to actually walk across here. And maybe we'll do a park in here. So we can encourage people to walk here. I don't know. I don't feel like they'll walk here. There's not going to be a lot of residential here. So there's going to be more residential here. And it's just easier to bring them over here. Have them walk to here. So if they want to go into this area, they can walk through the park. But give some money. If they want to come down a little farther. Oh, this, this cemetery is empty. We've got to get the other one going. They can take the transit to the MMT and then ride the met met monorail in. How are we doing over here? Only ten, a thousand's not too bad. I'll let that go. Twenty-two hundred. We need to. We need to oh, oh, good. This one's empty. Perfect. So these things are nice. We're on a nice dress schedule here. I've been harping about freaking uh, rotating your cemeteries. Hopefully, people are. This one empty? Close enough. Because this one's pretty close to needing to be emptied. So let's switch that. Then we do have a few sedentaries over here. Because people do die at work. I think we're good. I think we're good for now. Alright, let's go back to here. Um, yeah, so I, I don't know what we want to do with this space. I was going to put some, put some houses back here high density but we'll see and I wish on the PlayStation you could see what the terrain looks like because I see how there's a hill here but whatever we're gonna just build on the hill we're gonna build on a hill so we only got room for like one road maybe we can do it a little tighter and get two roads back here this is the border to our campus and we can make this a road and maybe put houses on here put the campus in here maybe we'll, we will do that Be like our. Uh, it's gonna be what is this length here? It's not gonna be a nice circle. So it's two. So we're gonna go to like over here. That's fine. We should make it a halfway decent curve. It's one and a half. The one and a half. Maybe we'll get rid of this road and then curve it down and loop it back. So maybe we'll do something like, yeah, maybe we'll, we'll make it a little tighter. If we do a, a one gap here, let's just see. 
Ooh, it's around the tra tra train track. I don't think I like that. If we do right here, right on top. Mm, we're also on the train track, aren't we? So, we're not going to be able to do it. So, let's just do like two and just leave the gap for the trains. I want to be on the curve tool. Or I should say the freeform tool. There's too many things to snap to. Too many things to snap to. Don't know where I'm going to snap. And we can do something like that and we can do... How far is this? One and a half. So we need to do like three quarters. It's like right here. And then like there. Should give us a pretty good circle. Yeah, that's okay. And I don't know what we do here. We just leave it empty. We know we may build something later. There's still a couple interconnecting blocks. And we'll make it a little higher density, so we'll make the blocks a little tighter. like envision this being like a like a dorm area for our even though we have dorms almost like a dorm area for our campus so we'll get rid of this road campus should be able to fill in some of this and probably some of this and maybe we'll just do a couple roads in here or maybe we'll do um maybe we'll park in here we need a green space i feel like we need a green space somewhere so maybe we'll do a, like a little park here Maybe we'll do maybe we'll we'll do the park like we'll do this like a park in like this will be in the park. Kinda like in between the park. And then maybe we'll raise the elevation in here. I guess maybe we'll do something like something a little goofy. It's like a nice like curved road that goes like this. And we can do we want to have any more connecting roads to this? Or we want to do a little curved road in the inside? From here. Oh. It's like an eye. It's the eye of Sauron. You know, something like that. And then if we want to connect these two, we can. We can leave a space here. Put something else there. We can, it doesn't matter. Is that going to give us no room for our campus? I don't know. Maybe we get rid of this road. We can, then we can put some campus stuff in here. And then we can run paths to, from these develop, these areas to the campus. Maybe we'll see. Or maybe we'll put a park back here. Put some water in here. And then we can park people over this way. I uh, do want to put a monorail in here. So where is that going to go? Maybe that's where I should go on that, that piece. Or do I want to put the monorail on this road here? Because it's got a pretty good access. You can put the monorail in here. It might, might not be too bad. Uh, it's going to be a little noisy, isn't it? So maybe we'll put it here. And we won't zone. In, in this block. We'll put some offices on. We can put offices there, put some trees there, so we can put a little park in there. To make a green space. Maybe this park will come into here. And we'll actually connect it to here so some people can take the monorail up into here. Or some people can just walk through the park. And stop and get a sandwich. So 
Maybe we'll do that. How's the angles gonna be when we when we approach this thing? Or we can do metro. Then we wanna put it back here. It's a little farther. So then it's like not like like I like it to be a little bit more central because then people will come from all sides. And if I put it here, then it's like there's nobody here, so no one like wants to come here. It's like okay, well people from like here and here might come. Okay, but if you put it here, maybe some of these folks come. You know, some people from over here come. You know, then we can do buses and stuff. So I think that's what we're gonna do. Let's put it here. Maybe we'll put it right there. Or maybe we just do tram. You know, we could do tram. It's not going to be that high density. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe we'll do tram. I have the tram line right here. So we could bring it in. You know, we could even have the tram line go underneath the bridge. Like have a turn, come underneath, come out here, and connect into here, and we could do tram all through here. Maybe this will be a little tram area. Yeah, I'm thinking that might be the way to do it. And then we can connect this station to this monorail. Or maybe we won't connect it to here. Because we'll connect the train there. We already did, I already did that. Then we'll connect this to the monorail here. We'll put a metro at the college from here. So we use like three, kind of use like three out of the eight things. Then maybe we'll just do tram. Or maybe we'll keep that monorail. We'll do tram in here to bring people here. And like a tram line that runs down here to bring people from in here and here. I don't know. Who who knows what we'll do? I don't know what I'm going to do. I didn't even know I was going to draw those roads two minutes ago. And then we did. So that was good. I still think we need to do something over here. So maybe we'll do that. We need more roads over here. But how we don't want to look? That's another question. We do something like this. Man, I might actually just keep that. Why not? I think we just keep that. Yeah, that was fine. Keep that, and then we need to do some interconnecting roads here. Maybe with this road we'll, we'll continue connecting here. And here. Oh, this is like a service road. I'll put recycle here. Saving. I'll recycle in that blank corner on the left. Yeah, so maybe two recycle centers there, two here. That will supply garbage for both sides. Should be plenty. And let's see. Maybe we can do something like here. I kind of want to hit it like right here. Do, 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 do. I like the shape. So I kind of want to keep that shape. So I don't know if I want to destroy it with this. Uh, it looks okay. Uh, it's probably okay. Uh, yeah, we'll just keep that. Uh, we'll keep it. It's one of the board of approval here. The board has approved. some roads that aren't center. Oh, I didn't want to destroy the whole road. Well, oh, I did. I 
Maybe some of these are off. What do you think? That's all right. That should be okay. So I think I want to do a park back here. Right in here. So we'll do a park here. I think this is going to look cool. In my brain it looks cool. Um, what did I say? On paper it looks good. Let's see if it looks cool on, on practice. So we'll... Uh, Maybe this will be the road the park's on. Park will be in there. Oh, we can do some neighborhoods in here. Are we going to do a road in here? A little bit of a slight bend. was interesting. I had the X button and that popped up. How did they know? That was okay. That's fine. It's doing what it's doing. Let's blow this piece up. And make yourself a nice curvy road. If you can get the, if you can get the line up. That yeah, looks about right. Alright. This is very tedious here right now, but that's okay. I don't want to connect to that in the spot, but it's not giving me like a, the node I want. I mean, the node's here. But then I can't get it to curve because that thing's, I might have to turn the snapping off to do it. Or maybe I just want to put something there. I will see. Go here. Maybe we'll go in the middle here. What is that? A helicopter? Helicopter. These are off, these are with, maybe we'll do some with here. I can leave a big block, that's fine. It's gonna be light residential back here. I'm not sure. I think so. Who knows? I don't know what I put. Who knows? We'll get rid of this sharp. Bend here. Okay. Maybe we won't do a park here. spot for one tree maybe two <laughs> all right I think we're done I think we're done in this area for as far as roads go I think it looks okay well that looks okay we'll go with that so what, how would you do it would you you know I got something that follows the river so it's gonna it's gonna introduce in some curves there's not a whole lot of grid but we got a, we got a grid right by the, this train here you know, these roads aren't exactly lined up because you know the highway itself is a little bendy so when we when I drew this 
square to like the highway it's not square to these things right so it's a little skewed I think we'll do a park here to here I will continue the mountain down into here raise the elevation put some elevation right in here hit a park in here and bring people to here you know bring people to here kind of connect this all together we'll put another park in here maybe we'll just let we'll continue the natural reserve kind of like theme but this will be smaller hills so like we'll have some gates and paths in here maybe just like a little campsite in here and maybe something in here or maybe we'll do the city park again because this is probably better for a city park like in the middle although we could put a lot of trees and stuff back here and we can make this like a little local campground I don't know mm, I don't know if I want to do that so maybe the city park here maybe the re reserve park here college would go here I think that's good uh, we gotta convert to roads so I'm kinda happy with it um, I think it's gonna look okay and then uh, So I'll go ahead and do that, and then we'll come back and chit chat some more, I guess. Alright, well, welcome back. Went ahead and uh, converted all those roads to dirts to paved roads. I saw a police officer driving around over here for whatever reason. Ain't nothing over here to police, but they just go where they're gonna go, you know? There's no police station anywhere near here. But that's okay. He can do what he's doing. Maybe he's just checking out the new area. Like, oh man, they're building a whole new neighborhood over here. This looks nice. I might move in. Let's see, we're doing pretty good with the ore. I checked on that just a second ago. We're at 772. Uh, and at 12, well, we might, we might hit them both right at the same time. You know, it kind of proves my point a little bit. Now we, uh, we're at like 600, and I zoned a bunch of those barracks things, and now we're almost at 800. And I didn't add any more people. I haven't added anything. All I did is added the, the barracks. So if you're having trouble leveling up your industry, because you can't get enough people, just throw down a bunch of stuff. But don't throw down extractors and processors willy-nilly because that'll mess up your whole supply chain. So just throw down like the maintenance buildings and the barracks or whatever. These are the barracks because they're like smaller. And you can fit more in. Ah, I think this looks pretty good. Now I think I, what I want to do is look at our districting because now I think things don't you know quite line up where they want where they were going to be. So let's. We can get rid of some of this because we're not going to district that. So what was what is this? This is default style, Gundam style. Boom, 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 boom. Gundam style. So what we can do here? Maybe we'll just make this a little taller. So this will be the um, European suburbia. No, European. I think that's what this. So I think that's the default map, right? I think it's European. I think European suburbia, I always get it confused, is this one, right? Oh, that's European. Okay. That was wrong. So this is European suburbia. Oh, with the taller taller ones. There. This one is the smaller one. So European is... Oh, yeah, because it's the opposite. I always think this suburbia should be low height. And these are all low height, but they're the European. The European suburb, yeah, it's tall. It's like the, and it's like these ones. It's a default. So we will do that with some tall guys back here. You know what we were doing over here. See how this isn't like, eh. It's like I don't know what we're doing here. Or do we want to put some? Maybe we'll just make this. Um, no, we're going to make this default. Did we make this? Ah, oh, high efficiency. We already did it. I see it there. First icon, high efficiency. We're going to do that. And we'll put a couple big, big, big guys in here. You know, a couple of these tall guys. There's a few. Because once again, it went a little bit of height as we get closer here. Because, you know, overall our city is kind of like low, low mixed density, high density, high density gonna be high then down to low on that tile and then it'll be on this tile it'll be low density you know like lowish mixed and then like a little bit of high density kind of carrying forward this way so I want the profile of the city to be taller 
kind of like in this area but like if you can imagine it it's going to be tall they're like this half and of course we're only buying these two tiles so like on these two tiles like half into those two tiles will be tall and then the other half will, it'll flatten out again and it'll be more like this you know it's going to have some height and maybe we can fix this so it's not as much height here but um it won't be like kind of packed like this is you know and I, I do want to fix this area a little bit because I'm getting rid of some of these other buildings that aren't quite like um, where you get like a lot of the same I don't know I don't know I mean maybe we'll leave it we'll see what we when we open up the other tiles how things like work out as far as the roads and stuff go and how it looks because all that water is going to be land and canals so yeah we'll see like I said we'll see let's go back to districting all right, so that'll be tall, tall stuff. That'll be the efficiency, self-sufficient. Some taller stuff mixed in with some other not so tall stuff. Then we're gonna have. Um, so here I'm gonna want to control the height better. So here we'll do something like maybe this development here. So I want to get rid of this here. I'm gonna make this the campus zoning along here. I don't know if we'll zone actually on this main on this semi main road. Probably not because that's where the park is. But maybe we'll do like here. Will be its own thing and that'll be um the uh university city style. So that will look more like this. So the university city style does not have high density um like skins or buildings but it has the low density and maybe what we'll do is I think I want to preserve kind of this brown or like small housey looking look like we have down here so I might uh, historicalize most of it maybe we'll get a couple of these in like a block or so so maybe we'll do I'll try and do you know that like along this road along the road here then some of those browner houses will be like in here. I think that might look nice. That would be nice for our campus. Almost like a little student off-campus off housing. Where you get like duplexes and stuff. Uh, let's see. District tool paint again. So that means this here will be... <coughs> excuse me. I don't know if we'll zone along here or not on this piece I'll push this out to here box that in and then maybe we'll push this in. oh this is going to be a park so it's probably not going to matter what we do here I just find it easier to actually do this with the bigger tool because with the smaller tool it like it snaps to like the, the corners too much like watch it just goes like like that I didn't even touch the button you know and it makes it like hard to make it on the road there you know Oop. snap to the road so it doesn't snap to the road when it's that big because it's like so far away from the road Oh, that's pretty good. Alright, so what do we got here? I think this is going to be the European suburbia. If I were correct. Oh, uh, sure, European. Uh, I'm confusing it again. I can't ever get this straight, guys. I tell you what. That's European. Well, I want it to look like this. So that's what that'll be. <laughs> that's how I want it to look. We'll do a couple just regular houses, and this is all going to be light residential, all on these blocks here. And then maybe even this block here, and then we'll do some high density filling in here, and maybe in here. And that's what I think we're gonna do. Yep. So we'll we'll, we'll make this. Yeah. There. I think that'll be look. That'll look pretty good. All right. So I'm kind of getting excited, man. I think it's gonna look nice when we're done. All right. So that's good. And then the next thing we should be the European suburbia. And it is. 
All right, level five, ore industry. It worked as I knew it would, like I'd done this before. We zoned, we put all those barracks down, and we got the people, and probably the, uh, what came first? The people were at uh, 135, and we had 118, 813. It was like perfect timing on both sides. So, um, yeah. Let's see, I've done this before. Oh, we can keep two barracks there for, for now. Oh, wait, I need, to, I need this, uh, the workers. Sorry. You gotta go. You got to go. Sorry. You've got to go. You've got to go. Nice knowing you, but you've got to go. All right, let's, uh, we got the main building. We need power over here, right? Do we have power? This has power, so these people can have power. That should be power there, and then we can come across to here, or we can just bring it from here. For now. And we need... Um, so it's going to be it's uh, forestry, and then we're, we're we're done with the DLC as far as uh, leveling things up. And we're going to need like a, a sawmill. One of these guys, maybe a couple of these guys, where he's want to go. I don't know. Maybe we'll put these in the, over here. Can put them along the back. Can we maybe follow this? Oh, maybe we can follow this. Let's put a rub back here. Because the sawmill is going to flatten the land. So I don't want to have too many cliffs in my area. If we put it back here, it shouldn't be too terrible. This is pretty flat. We'll put like two back here. They're a little far away from. We probably should put them up here because then that way they, they can drive to there. But we'll see if this becomes a problem. We can move them. We do have space up here to put assets. We could put it right here, but it's going to be in the train track, huh? Let's see what that looks like. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. My floor is through the train track. No. Don't do that, buddy. And you know what? Maybe we would put them up here. And then we'll put this. So maybe we'll put some of our extractor stuff up here and here. And we'll put the barracks and stuff back here. Yeah. That won't be so bad here. You know, and then maybe we can pull a road off here and put some stuff here. This might be too big for an area. Maybe we'll flat we'll flatten this out a little bit. We put some like the pulp factories back here. Or we'll, I kind of wanted them up front because it's like they would kind of go well with these because these are tall and big and they're big, pretty big and tall. So maybe we'll move these actually. I think we were gonna put stuff there, right? We'll put you here. Here. And we'll flatten and all this terrain a little bit. So the X button. Oh, on one something else. carried away. A little carried away. Come back. I hear like birds. Is it because there's a forest here? I don't really notice that. Yeah, like something like that. That's good. Turn on a storage unit. 
Oh, oh, don't do that yet. They'll be importing everything. Maybe we'll make these guys, um, yeah, we can do counter for here. Then maybe we'll keep that the, the beach, beach, and then we'll do the yacht or something like over here. So we can go ahead and turn, um, you won. You're at 18 already. What happened there? Must mean we want to put it down. Not against Post. Do we have water? We have water over here. I'm pretty sure. Where are you at? Well, you're at 18 as well. What happened there? Oh, well, you get to like 40. Ooh. Oh, uh, well, we have that now. Uh, I'm not happy about that, so we gotta change that. Pause the game real quick. What did I just do? Come over here real quick. Now let's do what do we gotta do here. Bring this out a little bit. That maybe. Flatten that out a little bit. this back and redraw our road that's ah, better hmm I don't know if I like it though folks just we gonna maybe push this up in here a little bit there that might take care of it gonna flatten it out because it's maybe I gotta go up to the hit start it here right here I'm saving again we're saving we're always saving that's better let's see this is gonna flatten it out here I can live with that that actually looks not bad I mean because it's somewhere on a hill that's cool we, I get we're on a hill so things are not as easy as they, we think and I did that on purpose to build this on a hill to give it a little bit of flex and a little bit of character Instead of having it all flat, because I could have easily made it flat. Oh, we're out of power over here. Well, that's not good at all. Who did that? Who did that? Did you do that? I did that? I don't think I would do it. Alright. Now we're doing okay over here. We're still having a little bit of problems. I mean, is that not going to go away? This ain't gonna be less trucks or anything, it'll be more. But that's to fix another day. Alright, so now we're back to here. You're at 42. You're at 20. We'll go ahead and get you going. And then we'll call it a day. We'll go ahead and get this. Yeah, I guess we call it here. It's about that time. Oh, I guess we can turn this on. Could you just run it without that on all the time? I don't know. Um, and then we'll fill up the storage unit. And then, um, once he gets kind of full, we'll, we'll turn these guys on. We'll get, get producing some, some, uh, that's by plain timber? I don't know what that makes. You make what? Yeah, plain timber. Because the other, other, pro other processed material is the, uh, paper. And then maybe we can look and see what factory we can put down that uses just plain timber. Once uh, our warehouse over here, that's the paper, get started filling up. Now everything's moving, so that's good. So this is working out okay. And we're almost like, I don't say like done with Industries DLC, but we, because we have more expansion to do. But I mean, I mean, we're all level three or level five. So the only thing that's going to drive increasing is some more unique buildings, unique factories, and then if we expand our commercial, which expands our industry, then our industry will need the processed and raw material.
to make things. So that'll kind of drive up the demand a little bit, but we're almost at like a steady state. This isn't too, too bad. Uh, let's see. All right, we're, we're delivering things here. That's good. Like I said, we'll come back next time. Maybe we'll tinker with this a little bit more. We'll continue um, kind of putting down some services and get this this area up and running. Maybe I'll uh, offline. I'll go ahead and put these parks in, at least the terraining, and you can kind of see that when I can get there. And uh, that's about it. Thank you for joining. I hope you had a wonderful time, and uh, good luck in your city. And see you next time.